Oh my god. Brad. Yeah. Come here for a sec. Come here. Look. My question is, did it did it grow out that long? Holy. Or did it just turn that color? Oh my god. I was just brushing my hair. I'm like, wait, what? Oh my god. How is that possible? How did did it grow out that gray or was it always that? I don't know, I'm just spotting it, just it now. Color. I don't get that. Do you think I should leave it? Yeah. Just embrace it, babe. Just embrace it, accept it. Accept it. Good luck with the video, babe. Thanks. Oh my gosh. Alright, so I just spotted a white hair while I was getting ready and that is my first white hair. Look, it's clearly right there. My first white hair at the age of 32. I think I should just leave it and accept it. It's pretty sad, but it's part of life. Wow. Okay, back to the video. Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing an unboxing. I have the Robot White wireless controller. And I'm going to be using this as my new controller when I'm like streaming or recording a gameplay. It's going to be for that only. Like I have my own wired controller that I use when I'm not filming. This one's going to be like my streaming controller. Because the one that I use right now, it's Power A wired controller. It's licensed by Xbox, but it doesn't support playing like hooking my elgato up with that controller so i had to get the official controller for my gameplays so my elgato can you know hook up to it easily without any problems so i decided to get the white one and not like the black one because i kind of like the idea of the black like i have a black console I kind of like the idea of the black console and white controller, like the black and white vibe. So I bought this controller from Walmart. It wasn't cheap at all. Like you think Walmart would be cheap, but it's not. Okay, so here it is. And when you open it, I'm pretty sure there's going to be batteries that pop out. Ta-da! I love seeing controllers coming with batteries. They're the double A batteries that you need to use with this controller. Alright, that's how it looks like. It's so pretty. Yeah, like I said, this is going to be specifically for my streaming videos, for when I'm recording a gameplay. It has grips on the trigger. So that's my old controller and my new one now. Honestly, they're the exact same thing. It's just different colors. But I do like the white better. Feels nice. I just hate one thing about it. I hate the clicking sounds. Other than that, I love it. Just that clicking noise is so annoying. But the one that I use for when I'm not streaming or for when I'm not recording a gameplay, it's... It doesn't make those clicking sounds, which I love because I, I 
I prefer it not to make clicking sounds for some reason. I feel like it's a distraction. It's such a distraction. I'll show you guys the controller that I use when I'm not streaming. Hang on. So this is the one that I use. It's wired. It works amazing. I love it. I would I would use this one too for when I'm recording a gameplay, streaming, but sadly it doesn't support the Elgato at all. Can't even hear it. The D-pads don't even make noises. But this one Yeah, you definitely, it's so loud. So the reason why I needed to get a new controller for my gameplays for when I'm recording, this controller is worn out now. It's two years old. Um, it came with my Xbox Series X. So, well, it's a little over a year old. Almost a year, almost two years old. It'll be two years in November. So I've been using it every single day ever since. And now like the and now like the joysticks don't work as well as they used to at all. So it's like not playable anymore. When I'm going straight using my joysticks. Hang on. Oh. Oh yeah. This controller is definitely worn out. Like these joysticks are completely kind of destroyed. <laughs> Like, there's not that much grip anymore. And then over here, in the new one, you can see there's a better grip here. So as I was saying, when I'm going straight in a game, like when I'm walking straight using my um, joysticks, it doesn't go straight. Like, it will stop for like 10 seconds and then it will go and then I'll start walking and then I'll stop again. So yeah, that's definitely not playable, you know? Can't use that. All right, so I'm gonna go stream now with my new controller. Hopefully it works. If not, I have the receipt. This was for $90 with tax. It's pretty expensive, you know? My wired Power 8 controller was for 56 with tax. All right, well, I'm gonna go stream now on twitch i hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing kind of random video kind of unboxing um and i will see you guys in my next video bye